What's up everybody, my name is Delicious Darren, and today I'm going to be showing you a fairly easy and consistent way to do the Lakitu skip. So let me go ahead and do it a few times to show you what it's going to look like when you get this down. Uh, of course I'll be using an emulator and save states throughout the duration of this video. So there's one, we're going to go for three in a row, and then a couple more after I finish the uh, describing the uh, actual uh, method. So that was two, and finally three. So as you can see, once you get this down, you should be able to get it pretty much nine times to ten times out of ten, which would be completely awesome. So let's go into the actual tutorial section of this video. Um, first of all, we need a couple of reference points. The first reference point being this wall right here. We want to like look in between these two indentations, and this is where we're going to be aiming for with our first two long jumps as so just like that so um, we'll long jump a couple times towards that area next we want to come over here and we want to position ourselves right in between the left side of this bridge we want to make Mario's legs in between the left side of this bridge likewise when we're jumping when we're long jumping we want to make sure that the legs stay in between this line right here and that will be our reference point to make sure that this Lakitu succeed Lakitu skip succeeds so once again this is what it looks like and um, I'm gonna do it a couple more times and then we're going to explain some of the things you need to be looking out for in general that uh, don't necessarily go with the particular tutorial six six session section sorry <laughs> session section <laughs> that word is really hard for me right now for some reason alright so what do we need to be looking out for? Let me get this mouse out of the way. I apologize for that. Um, see, the reason we do this at all, the reason we're even like going up here and then turning to the left, is because of the angle. We want to get a really, really good angle on this portion right here. For instance, let's go all the way back to the beginning. If we went straight ahead, this is the angle we'd be looking at. And as you can see, we can do it right here. Oh wow, <laughs> um, we can do it like that, but um, it's a lot harder, and that's mainly used for optimal speed if you're looking for a super, super fast speed run. So what we want to do is, the whole reason we're even going over here is to get a good angle for this. We want to make sure that it's as easy as possible for us while saving a decent amount of time. Another thing you may want to note once you're up here and once you get really really good at it you may just want to do like a little side hop like that so that you can save just a extra millisecond of time I would definitely not suggest it to begin with because it might throw off your uh, positioning just kinda keep going with this um position yourself and then jump and then angle yourself correctly to where Mario's legs are right in between the correct area and um well guys I believe that's it um tune in next time. I'm planning on continuing to, to uh, make some um, Mario speedrunning tutorials just for the heck of it. And finally, let's look at Lakitu's beautiful... F oh god! <laughs> okay, wait. Let's look at Lakitu's beautiful face. Here we go, here we go. Yeah! That teleport! Mm. See you guys next time, and thank you for watching. 